What's up guys and welcome back to the Super Cooper behind the scenes channel. We realize we haven't uploaded enough over here. We're trying to figure out exactly what we want to do and how we're going to get on an upload schedule and stuff like that. But uh, today we wanted to give you guys a little update on our duckies. Oh my goodness. So you guys remember them from a couple episodes ago. This is Rico right here. He is still doing A-OK. -okay. He visits us just about every day. Every Excited as always. Five and seven and every morning between about five and seven. <laughs> He's on a schedule. Um, <laughs> we've been feeding him the same stuff that we had earlier, the, the like combo of like corn and peanuts and everything. Chelsea also got some like non-boiled peanuts. These are just that fresh. They Peanuts, just they like, really, really like, yeah. and we literally just figured out a second ago because I had a bag, of, a bag of popcorn. He really, really likes popcorn, especially the kernels. Hey, buddy. Hey, Rico. Look, there's more popcorn. He really likes the popcorn. I don't think it's as good for him as the other stuff, but it's it's a little treat. So you guys can see he's the only one right here. I don't know where Lucia is. So Lucia's been coming pretty much all the time with him, right? The two of them, I mean, obviously they're kind of like a pack or a flock or whatever you want to call it for birds, but sometimes they'll split up and like Rico will come from over there and Lucio will come from over there and they'll like meet up here and stuff. You guys may notice that we're talking about Rico and Lucia and there was a third one, Tiga. Now, Tiga, she was, she was a special case. She was really cute. Like, I, we really liked her and she was very, she was like soft spoken if that makes sense. Like, I feel like she'd be a soft spoken person. She was very timid and she made like these really sweet little sounds and stuff. She wasn't quite as aggressive towards food as the other two. And honestly, even if you dropped it in front of her face half the time, she wouldn't even like know where it was. So she was just a little bit off. I don't know if she just wasn't very intelligent or what. But we actually haven't seen her in a while. And it makes me feel bad to talk about her that way, but I'm just trying to be honest with you guys. Probably From the start, she was yeah. the one that seemed like she didn't belong, like she was the runt. And she hasn't been here in how long do you think? Has it been over a week now? I mean, the last time I saw her was like a day or two before the episode. Oh, so it's, so it's been longer than that. So yeah, we, um, we have not seen her. Uh, Rico, like I said, Rico and Lucia, have always been coming back. Rico's the man. Lucia was always our favorite of the three. <laughs> he's full. So. <laughs> yeah, he's done. See he'll, he'll see us later. <laughs> For whatever reason, I guess Lucia didn't come tonight. Hopefully she's okay. We have no clue what happened. I mean, for all we know, Tiga could be fine and just somewhere else, but we just haven't seen her personally, so. Yeah. Makes us kind of sad, but uh, I mean, hopefully she's okay wherever she is. The other thing is they, I mean, there could be babies somewhere. We just don't know. Oh, I didn't even think about that. What if Tiga had babies and she's sitting on them? She's sitting on the nest. Yeah. If, if she had babies somewhere far away on the lake, she wouldn't come this far to get food. We'll keep you guys updated. Hopefully, Lucia comes to visit tomorrow, so we'll we'll show you guys Lucia. She's fine and dandy, just as always. Our girl Lucia. And uh, this like is her. this is the first of a few updates to come, so stay tuned. Well, this is weird. Just a little bit later and there's a new group of ducks over on this side of the lake. There's three or four of them. You just saw the one go behind the fence. But they're all, all brown. They couldn't be Tiga's babies, could they? I don't know. They look kind of small. I mean, they, they look like they're, they're grown. They're not ducklings. How long does it take a duck to grow? A couple weeks? Probably, maybe three, four? So, if these were adolescent ducks, that might potentially make sense. I will have to look it up. We'll have to look up the timeline and stuff. I know nothing about it. But we have definitely not seen these ducks before. And there they go. That was weird. It's a group of five of them. We have seriously never seen these ducks before. They are smaller though, so I wonder if they're a family. We'll have to look up what Muscovy ducklings look like. I know the ducklings are yellow and black, but maybe like the mid-range, the mid-age gets brown. I don't know. This could be the start of something pretty exciting. I had to show you this before we left. All right, so we're getting ready to leave on a cruise. You guys are gonna see it on the vlog channel. But this morning, I took Cooper out to go potty and he immediately ran over to this corner of the house. That is a good sign. Poo. That's fresh duck poo. I mean, 
we're not happy about the poo, but we're happy that they were here. That means they were here. So it's been about another week since we last talked to you guys in this update. We have not seen them at all, like not once. We haven't even seen them swimming around out there. So we were really, really worried, but then I saw this this morning and this is a good sign because this was not here yesterday. Just left for the cruise and as we're driving down the street, I started screaming because look who I found. Babe, there's still no Tiga though. Tiga's still missing. My friends. Hey guys. Hi, where you been? Hi, duck, 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 duck. Where have you been? All right guys, enjoy your brunch. Happy to see you. So we have been gone for five days on the cruise. We got back late last night. And this Hello. morning, we've got Lucia here. What's up, girl? How are you? We've missed you. We were gone for the whole week. You can. Like, okay, but where's the peanuts, though? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay I'll get them. I'll get them for you. <laughs> so I'm fairly sure my mom has been feeding them and taking care of them and stuff, which is good. That's good. We haven't seen Tiga still, but where did Chelsea? Where did that other one go? I'm looking at Coop upstairs. Yep, she's hungry, okay, Miss. But we only eat in the grass. <laughs> We, we don't eat on the pool deck because we poop on the pool deck. <laughs> this is ridiculous. So the reason why we picked up the camera here is because we just saw another black and white duck, which you guys know we were saying that we've seen Rico and we've seen Lucia, but we have not seen Tiga in a while. But where'd, where'd she go, Chelsea? I don't, I don't see that other duck. Oh yeah, look right here. This is a, a new duck. This That's not Tiga. That one's big. Is that a male? Tiga was white and black on the body. This one's all black on the body. Yeah, this one has- Yeah, you look, Lucia's colors have changed since we first saw her, so I got excited. It's bigger than Rico, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Rico used to be the king. What in the world? We have never seen this one before. This doesn't make any sense. He just decided to hop up on the fence. Look at his colors. Hi. Let's go check him out. So a quick Google search did not give us any information. I searched like Muscovy duck turns black and it didn't give me anything. He's about Rico's size. He wags his tail like Rico and he sounds like Rico, but that's not to say that other ducks don't do that. So I really, I mean, he's hanging out with Lucia, which it was, it's been them two for a couple weeks now. I honestly don't know. This is weird. I find it weird that he would have turned all black and grew a mohawk, but sometimes you just go through a crazy phase in your life and you just feel like you gotta change things up a bit. Whoever he is, he's got cool colors. He's all black, he's got the shiny coat up top. He's pretty. He's pretty. Oh my God, there's no way. There's no way. I think there is. It's, it's been a month since we've seen her. We were completely wrong just a few minutes ago. That's Tiga. All three of them are lined up on the fence right now. Can you guys see that? That's so funny. They're all on different levels. Rico is down there on the bottom left. Lucia's is in the middle. And that's Tiga on the right. How did she get so big? I don't know. I don't know. Coop, Coda, what? Hold on. This is unbelievable. We haven't seen her in a month. She comes back and she's the biggest one of all three. Rico, how do you feel about that, dude? What? There's Rico down there. Lucia's in the middle and Tiga's on the right. Yeah, that's definitely Rico. Doing the yeah, little head yeah, bob thing. <laughs> that's, that's Rico. What in oh the world? God. Lucia, you're so big. Tiga used to be the same size as Lucia. She's now twice her size. Rico, you're a butthead. <laughs> he just pushed Lucia off. Well, I'm gonna give her the peanuts then. I can't believe that that's... I'm, I'm amazed. I, I'm so happy. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I, we said that we hoped that she had like found her own and had, had you know, kind of created a new home or something. I, I kind of thought she had was gone. I thought, I thought she had yeah. passed. I, I thought she didn't make it. I thought she got sick. We have hawks around here. Maybe one of the hawks got her or something. That's honestly what I was kind of assuming. That's what we had thought for the last couple days, or last couple weeks, I mean. But she is alive and well. Okay, so, Rico, we get it. <laughs> all three of our little duckies are alive and well. This is I like the best that. news ever. 
Oh my goodness, this is so amazing. Uh, lady, are you gonna give him some food? Because he's asking well, for it. You have to get down. You're not a dog. You can't catch it. Well, try it. You haven't tried it with him. Here we go. Duck, 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 duck. <laughs> this is crazy. I can't believe it. I'm so I'm happy. So happy. Where's the corn? Where's the peanuts? Lucia, what are you doing? She's gonna. I thought she was gonna try and stand on that little knob. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, there you have it. Uh, this is way better of an ending to this duck update video than I was expecting. I'm so surprised. I'm shocked. I, I mean, we just we just got back from the cruise, so we'll let you guys know how like the next week or so goes. For a while there, they were coming every single day, and then it got a little bit more sporadic, and then obviously Tika disappeared. But are they going to keep coming back every single day? I don't know. We're going to have to go and get some more peanuts, get some more corn, and we'll we'll see what happens. But at least for now, we know they're all alive and well. So that's good. That's good. Good update. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, sir? Where's the peanuts? Coop, what is it? What's going on? Do you see that duck? <laughs> hey, don't be mean. That's Lucia, you know her. She's a nice duck. She doesn't want to play, Coopy. Coda, what do you think? Do you see it? No. Nope. I don't even think he sees. <laughs> Coda, do you see it? Do you see the thing in the backyard? Over there. Go right here. What's that? He's looking at <laughs> Koda, hey, look, over here. Look. Look out there. Do you see it? <laughs> well do you... There. Oh. Oh. Do you do you see it? Yeah, there's something in the door. No, he doesn't see it. He's looking at the front door. Dakota, out there on the pool deck. Out there, right out there. Okay, I'm gonna test to see if he knows that it's there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna open up the door and we're gonna see where he goes. Okay, so he did see her. Coda, be nice, be nice, be nice. <laughs> Rico's yelling at him. Dakota. <laughs> Dakota. <laughs> Come on home, bud. We, we got it from here. The mystery continues. As you can see, we have one, two ducks, three, four ducks. There's four ducks. Four duck alert. Which one is not my duck? I think this is, that one looks a lot like Rico. This is the one that's hanging out with Lucia and it keeps coming up to see me, so that's gotta be Rico, right? Who are you? Who are you? Did you bring new friends? He looks so much like Rico, except maybe even bigger. And then that's the one that we saw earlier today that we thought was Tiga, but now I'm not certain. And then these are my little buddies. These are the ones that have been around forever. I feel like Rico and Lucia were like, hey, come meet our friends. And yeah. Brought them over to hang out. This has been such an interesting day. It's, we haven't seen these ducks in so long. Well, we haven't been home. We saw Rico and, and Lucia not too long ago. We haven't seen Tiga in over a month, and we've never seen this guy. Is this like her new boo thing? This, like, this is just the place to hang out, I guess. This is so good, ridiculous. Is it just going to keep multiplying? Like. Next month? Next month are we gonna have six? I don't know. I don't want to disappoint you not bringing us babies. Unreal.